The following is a class on the Srimad Bhagavatam, first canto, second chapter, text number 32, given by His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on November 11th, 1972, in Vrindavan, India. Translation The Lord as Super Soul pervades all things, just as fire permeates wood, and so he appears to be of many varieties, although he is the absolute one without a second. Jatahi avahito bani daru seka sadin tu nane vabhati vishyatma bhute suja tatapuma. The Supreme Personality of Godhead, Krishna, is uh, residing along with the living entity within the heart. Ishara Sarvabhutana Vridhese Arjuna Tishthati. This is confirmed in the Bhagavad Gita. The Ishara, the Supreme Personality, is residing in everyone's heart. In another place it is said, hmm, hmm. Khetra Khetragya chapter, Khetrang Anchapi Mang Vidhi Sarva Khetri Subhara. Khetragya means the knower of the body. Uh, that I, you, every one of us, we are individual living entities. We are also Khetragga. I know this is my body, this is my finger, this is my hair, this is my leg. Ga. Ga means one who knows. So, I know, you know, you know about your body, I know about my body. Therefore, we are all Khetragyas. Khetragya means one who knows about his field of activities. Everyone has been given, awarded a certain type of field of activities for sense enjoyment. We want a certain type of body, certain type of sense enjoyment, and Krishna gives us the facility through the agency of material nature. Prakite kriyamanani, gunai karmani sarva. Actually, you are dependent. I want something. Krishna gives us through the material agent. At the same time, he also accompanies as a friend. The footnote is there. Da saparna sajuja sakhaya samanam briksham parishadjati tayo anya pipalam shadati. Anyam anni vicha sakshati. Suti mantra. So, both the living entity and the super soul is sitting on the same tree. This body is supposed to be the tree, and the heart is supposed to be the nest. And in the nest, as there are two birds, similarly, 
there is one bond, the living entity, individual, and the super soul, both. One is eating the fruit, the other is simply observing, witnessing. Anumanta upadrishta. Anumanta means giving order. Just like a child wants to take something, but he also uh, depends on the order of the father. Uh, yeah. The child is insisting, Father, I want this. Uh, father says, No, you don't take it. Uh, I shall touch it. I shall touch the fire. Father says, no, <coughs> don't touch it. Hmm? But he is insisting and crying. The father says, all right, you touch. Similarly, uh, we create our own uh, fortune and misfortune. Jīja-thāmāṁ prapaddhanti tāṁsa bhajāmo so, the father wants us to do something else, but we want to do something else against the wish of the father. Similarly, Krishna wants that every one of us should surrender unto him and work according to his direction, but we want to do against his will. Therefore, we create our own fortune and misfortune. That is the way. So, uh, there are different types of body and each one is acting in a different way. Uh, different way means the why they are working different way? If the Supreme Personality of Godhead Paramatma is the same in the in each and every body, Ishara Sarva Bhutana Vidya Why one is acting different from the other? Uh, that one is acting different that is that is the action of the individual soul. The super soul is there simply sanctioning. All right, you do like this. Uh, because he is insisting and he is sanctioning. All right, you do like this. Uh, therefore, naneva bhati vishvatma, vishvatma, the super soul, uh, the Supreme Personality of Godhead, he appears to be acting differently. He is not acting differently. Uh, just like the magistrate. Magistrate is giving different judgment. Uh, this man should be treated like this, this man should be treated. The man, the magistrate is the same. But because the uh, culprit is different. Therefore, he has got to give different judgment. Culprit is different. Uh, he is not different. He is one. Uh, this is the proof that Paramatma and Jīvātmā are two different personalities. They are not one. This is the proof. Why naneva bhati vishvatma? His vishvatma, the super soul. Why one is acting as a hog, one is acting as a dog, one is acting as a demigod, Indra, Chandra, Varun? Why these differences? Huh? We are all living entities. Uh, jiva tattva and the Vishwatma, the super soul is the same in everyone's heart. Why they are acting differently? 
This is the proof that there is individual soul, Jivatma and this Paramatma. Paramatma is sanctioned. The same example. The magistrate or judge is giving different judgment because the criminals or the complainants they are different. Nanima Bhati Vishatma Bhuteshu Tathapuma. The example is given. Jatha hi avahita bhanni darushu. In every wood there is fire. A small wood, there is small fire. And a big wood, there is big fire. The fire is the same. But according to the different size of the wood fuel, the uh, the uh, or the flames of the fire appears to be different. The flames of the fire appears to be different because uh, the living entity is different from different types. They have got different desires. Uh, according to the contact of the material quality. Karanam gunasanga asya sadasad janma jonish. This is explained in the Bhagavad Gita. Why they are different? Hmm? Because karanam, the cause is, karanam means cause, is uh, guna sangha asya asya of this living entity uh, he is associating contacting different qualities there are three qualities satagon rajagon tamagon and again if you mix these three qualities then three into three it becomes nine then again mix it the nine into nine it becomes eighty one. Therefore there are eight million four hundred thousand species of life. Uh, different qualities. Naneva. Uh, Naneva bhati. Uh, and in every living entity, within the heart of every living entity, the Vishatma, the super soul is there. So he is not different. Uh, as like the uh, darushu, as the fuel wood are different, and therefore the flame appears to be different. Uh, similarly, although Vishatma, the super soul, is one, because he is acting with the individual soul differently according to his different association, mentality, desires, every account is. Uh, just imagine how many uh, numberless there are living entities. Asankhya, jiva bhaga sabi gya, so asankhya kalpate. There is no, you cannot, any human world. And each and every individual soul is doing according to his own desire. And every account is kept. Just imagine how uh, expert accountant is required. Uh, every account is kept because he has to be offered again another body taking account of his activities. Karmana daivanetrino. He is acting. Uh, any human living at it is. So, how big brain is Krishna, as you can just imagine. And not only one planet, there are innumerable planets, there are innumerable universes, uh, everything innumerable. Uh, that is called unlimited. Uh, everything innumerable. And he still, some rascal claims that he is God. Uh, how much brain a God requires he does not know uh, how big brain, uh, anayat, 
इतरतेशु इतरतास्चा आर्थेशु अभिज्ञा these are uh, analyze what is the nature of the absolute truth अथात ब्रह्मा जिज्ञासा how is what he is immediately the answer is जन्मात्मसे जता from him everything is emanating everything is taking birth from him janma janma not only janma but but existence maintenance janmaadi janmaadi means birth maintenance and death creation maintenance and annihilation janmaadi ah asya Anything you take, asya, uh, janmaadi jasya, uh, janmaad dasya jataha. From whom everything is emanating, everything is taking birth. This cosmic manifestation, it is being maintained in him. And again, when it is annihilated, it enters into his own energy. Prakriting uh, maam, gachati. From his prakriti, uh, from his energy, Krishna's energies, external energy, uh, these five elements come out: earth, water, fire, air, sky. Uh, five gross element and three subtle elements: mind, intelligence, ego. Uh, this is the eight. These are the eight elements of material creation. Then all the living entities, those who wanted to enjoy this material world, they are impregnated within this material energy, and they come out with different bodies for enjoying different types of sufferings or uh, happiness. There is no happiness; is all suffering. But we take it is happiness. That is called illusion. So in this way. Uh, the whole creation is going on under the direction of Krishna. That is also stated in the Bhagavad Gita. Maya dhakshe na prakriti swati sa chala charam. Under his supervision, just imagine how expert supervision is there. That the sun is rising exactly in the same moment. As it is to be done, uh, the waves of this sea are going on perpetually, but the waves cannot come beyond the limit. We have walked on the sea beach, uh, so just at ten, one or uh, uh, three feet away, the big ocean, Pacific Ocean, is. But we are certain. That this Pacific Ocean cannot come beyond this limit, we are certain. How we are certain? Because there is the order of Krishna. Maya dhakshe na. Because we now I know you know that there is God's order. The Pacific Ocean may be very very big, but still He cannot disobey the order of the Supreme. Oh. माया धक्षे ना प्रकृति स्वयं सचराचरम दिस इज अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ कृष्ण कृष्ण कॉन्शसनेस मींस यू हैव टू स्टडी एवरीथिंग हाउ थिंग्स आर गोइंग ऑन एंड दिस इज स्टेटेड यू हैव टू सिंपली थिंक यस यू हैव टू कॉन्फर्म बाय योर ब्रेन इफ यू हैव गॉट डल ब्रेन देन हाउ यू कैन स्टडी हाँ Krishna says in the Bhagavad Gita that Maya dhakshe na prakriti swati sacharacharam. The prakriti, the material nature, is working under his direction, and you can uh, verify it how nature is working correctly, exactly, unless there is some systematic uh, order how everything is working systematically. Hmm. As soon as there is spring, uh, immediately thousands and millions of trees 
immediately the foliage comes off. Uh, immediately. And as soon as there is fall, uh, September last, all the leaves fall down immediately. Uh, so this is the process of creation. Uh, just like in Bible it is said, let there be creation and there was creation. So it is fact, actually. Uh, but we cannot understand how much powerful is Krishna or God simply by his will. Uh, simply by his will, everything takes place. Millions and millions of things come out uh, immediately, and millions and millions of things immediately annihilate. That is Krishna, that is God. Uh, so, the super soul, Vishwatma, he is one. But uh, because we are different, therefore we are acting differently. Uh, the question may be raised that in Vishwatma, the super soul is one, why there are different activities? The different activities is due to our will, our selection. I want to act in this way. So he gives the facility. Uh, 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 just like uh, somebody wants to drink, uh, the government gives license for liquor shop. Now, it is not that everyone is drinking, but there is facility for the drunkards. Because the drunkards want to drink, so government gives facility, all right, here is a liquor shop, you drink. Uh, but as soon as you commit some offense by drinking, you are arrested. So this arrest of the drunkard, is it a government's will or the person created such situation to be arrested? Uh, so they, in this way, the whole world is going on. Uh, Samohang sarvabhuteshu nami deshasti napriya. Krishna says, I am equal to everyone. Uh, I don't, I am not envious of everyone, uh, anyone, or I am friendly to everyone. Uh, he is friendly, actually he is friendly, but people say, accuse him, why God has created this distress? Why I am suffering? You are suffering for your own fault. God created you to become happy. He is happy. You are part and parcel of Krishna. You should be happy. But you don't accept the way of happiness. That is your fault. You don't accept. Krishna says that you shall be happy in this way. Voktanam jagutam sam sarvaloku maheshwaram sridam sarvabhutanam gyatam am santimichyati. Why you claim? Is it your property? Why you claim? Everything is belonging to Krishna. That is your fault. So you must suffer. You are a thief. Stena evasa uchyate. Anyone who does not offer things to Krishna before using, he is a thief. Uh, that is prasadam. That is Vaishnava philosophy. The whole process is to accept the Supreme. Uh, so long we do not accept the Supreme, that is Maya. Uh, that is Maya. Uh, that is going on. Nobody wants to accept the Supreme. Everyone wants to become Supreme. Uh, even after performing uh, severe austerities, penances, uh, still they want uh, to become one with the Supreme. Uh, uh, this is also Maya. Therefore, Bhagavad says, Vimukta Manina. They are thinking that after undergoing such severe austerities and penances, now he has become God. And that is Maya, he does not know. He is not God. But he claims like that, falsely. Uh, and this is the cause of his suffering. Uh, nobody can be no, can become God or equal to God. That is not possible. Uh, the same uh, quotation, Ekola Ishar Krishna Harsa Bhritta. 
uh, only the supreme god uh, supreme person isha supreme controller is krishna uh, krishna stu bhagavan sam you are why he was rascal trying to become bhagavan god this is maya he does not know he is thinking that i become god uh, this is maya abhishuddha uh, buddha abhishuddha buddha means his intelligence is not yet clean it's still dirty although he has undergone uh, good austerities penances uh, or taken sannyas but the mind is dirty uh, mind is dirty so that will not help uh, the whole process is chita darpana marjanam we have to clean our heart we have to understand our position uh then it will be successful if we don't clean our heart by regular chanting chita darpana marjanam bhava mahadavagni nirpapanam sriya kairava chandika vitaranam vidyavadhu jivanam anandam divadhanam pratipadam purnam itasvadan sarvatma sapanam param vijayati shri krishna sankirtan so we have to understand our position uh, the dirty things uh, should be uh, removed completely all is by hearing krishna katha uh, that is the way of understanding only way uh, this brindavan is so uh, important valuable why because anywhere you go in bindavan there is the opportunity of hearing krishna katha this whole bindavan is simply cultivation of krishna consciousness unfortunately we take to other consciousness here uh, and therefore we become condemned uh, in bindavan if we take other consciousness then we become condemned condemned means he is still the opportunity is there condemned to accept a, a body other than human being but he is helped because he is in bindavan he is uh, making progress even as animal as hogs and dogs he is making progress because he is in bindavan so bindavan is so important because here uh, anyone can get the opportunity of uh, krishna consciousness that would be so important uh, bindavan dham dham means where krishna resides that is called dham uh, bindavan dham aradh bhagavan brijesh tanayo tad dhamam dham means residence tad dham brindavan uh, so bindavan is not polluted bindavan is always helping us anyone who comes to bindavan uh, he he is helped immediately even though he is a uh, criminal number 1 uh, but if we remain in criminal mentality in bindavan then we have to accept another birth to suffer uh, then it will be all right and then again he will be liberated uh, due to bindavan the bindavan influence will act but uh, uh, if we uh, commit uh, uh, something against the bindavan principle then we have to accept uh, ग्रेजुअली Then you again come to human form of body. Then again 
if you are intelligent enough, you can utilize. But in Vrindavan, the karmani nidhati. Suppose for your sinful criminal acts, you become hogs and dogs. Next life, you are enlightened. That is karmani nidhati. Oh. The karma, the cycle of creative activities is reduced. But you have to accept. You have to accept. Oh. But nidhati. But why should we waste our time? Accepting another body of dogs and hogs, that we should be very much careful. Uh, although it is nidda, it is reduced. Why should we accept even that reduced punishment? That should be our principle. Uh, uh, but we do not know. Uh, we commit ignorance. That what Bhupu Goswami has described. Sinful activities are done due to ignorance, uh, agyan. Just like a child touches the fire, everyone knows if you touch fire it will burn, but the child out of ignorance touches. Therefore the child is under the protection of the parent so that uh, the child may not do something wrong and suffer. Uh, so naneva bhati vishyatma bhuteshu chatathapuma. These varieties of uh, living entities, it is due to the uh, variety of desires of the living entity. Otherwise, vishyatma is one. He is one. And the living entity is also one because he is the manifestation of marginal potency of the Supreme. Therefore, as marginal potency, the living entity is one. Pandita Samadarshana. One who knows that the living entity is their part and parcel of Krishna and they belong to the marginal potency. Uh, therefore, they do not see any difference out of the varieties of bodies. He sees only the spirit soul. Uh, and uh, be, due to the varieties of body, the activities are different, although the director, the supreme soul, super soul, is the same one. This is the conclusion. Jatha vanni abohito, jathahi abohito vanni darusu eka sajanisu naneva bhati vishyatma. Uh, so, according to our body, we act differently. Uh, the direction and sanction is there by the super soul. Uh, this is the part of this verse. Thank you very much. Thank you.